Imagine a rock, a big one, hurtling through the void of space. This isn't any ordinary rock, it's an asteroid, specifically Apophis. Now let's get to know our celestial intruder. Named after the Egyptian god of chaos, Apophis is a sizable space rock, about 370 meters in diameter. That's roughly equivalent to the length of four football fields. It's moving at a breakneck speed of over 67,000 miles per hour. That's faster than any vehicle we've ever built. In five short years in 2029, Apophis will make a close approach to our home planet, Earth. When we say close, we're talking within 19,000 miles. That's closer than some of our geostationary satellites. It's a cosmic dance that happens every few decades, but this time it's different. This time, Apophis will come closer than it ever has before. Now, let's consider the potential impact. If, and it's a big if, Apophis were to collide with Earth, the energy released would be equivalent to over a billion tons of TNT. That's tens of thousands of times more powerful than the atomic bomb dropped on Hiroshima. It would be a catastrophic event, causing widespread destruction and loss of life. But before we get too carried away with the doomsday scenarios, it's important to note that the chances of Apophis colliding with Earth are incredibly small. NASA estimates the odds at about 1 in 250,000. So while it's not impossible, it's highly unlikely. So why all the fuss about Apophis? Well, it's due to the intriguing question of how Earth's gravity will affect the asteroid during its close approach. Will it alter its trajectory? Could it potentially send it on a collision course with Earth in the future? But don't start building your bunkers just yet. There's more to this story. To understand this asteroid, we need to dive into the science of gravity. Imagine holding a ripe apple in your hand. Now, let it go. It falls, right? That's gravity at work. It's the invisible pull that Earth exerts, tugging everything towards its center. But gravity isn't confined to our planet. It's a universal force, a cosmic glue that holds the universe together. It governs the movement of planets around the Sun, the Moon around the Earth, and even the path of a small asteroid like Apophis. Let's imagine gravity is a dance. Picture the Sun and the planets twirling around in the vast dance floor of space. Each celestial body, from the smallest asteroid to the largest star, is both a dancer and a choreographer. It moves according to the gravitational pull of others, but also influences their movements with its own gravitational field. In this cosmic ballet, the strength of a dancer's pull, or gravitational force, depends on two things, mass and distance. The more massive the dancer, the stronger its pull. And the closer the dancers, the stronger the gravitational attraction between them. Consider Earth and the Moon. The Moon, though much smaller than Earth, exerts a gravitational pull that causes tides on our planet. That's because it's close to us. On the other hand, the Sun, despite being much farther away, has a powerful gravitational pull because of its enormous mass. It keeps Earth and other planets in their orbits. Now let's bring Apophis into the picture. As it approaches Earth in 2029, it will begin to feel our planet's gravitational tug. Like a new dancer entering the floor, its path will start to change, influenced by the pull of Earth's gravity. The closer it gets, the stronger this gravitational dance becomes. However, the outcome of this encounter isn't as straightforward as you might think. It's not just about Earth pulling Apophis towards it, it's also about Apophis' speed and direction, its mass and shape, and even its spin. All these factors will play a role in determining how much Earth's gravity will alter Apophis' trajectory. Will it be a slight shift, barely noticeable in the vastness of space? Or will it be a dramatic swerve, changing Apophis' future path significantly? Well. That's a question scientists are still trying to answer. But one thing is certain, in this dance, it's not the tiny asteroid that leads. It's Earth, with its much larger mass and stronger gravity, that sets the pace and dictates the steps. So, in 2024, when Apophis comes calling, it's Earth's gravity that will take the lead in this celestial dance. This interplay of forces, this cosmic choreography, is a fascinating example of how everything in the universe is connected, bound together by the invisible strings of gravity. Now, let's dive a bit deeper into the potential impact of Earth's gravity on Apophis during its close approach. Every object in space exerts a gravitational pull on every other object. And when an asteroid like Apophis comes close to a larger body like Earth, that gravitational pull can have a significant effect, potentially altering the asteroid's trajectory. Imagine a spinning top. As it spins, it stays in a relatively steady position. But if you were to give it a little nudge, 
it would wobble and potentially change its course. That's essentially what could happen to Apophis. As it speeds through space on its current path, Earth's gravity will give it a slight nudge, causing it to wobble and possibly veer off its original course. This doesn't mean that Apophis will suddenly take a sharp turn and head straight for Earth. Instead, the change in trajectory will be subtle, only a few degrees. However, when you're dealing with the vast distances of space, even a slight change can have an enormous impact. It's also worth noting that the effect of Earth's gravity on Apophis will depend on how close the asteroid comes to our planet. The closer Apophis gets, the stronger the gravitational pull and the more significant the potential change in trajectory. This gravitational dance will reach its crescendo at the moment of closest approach when Apophis will be most strongly influenced by Earth's pull. It's at this critical moment that the asteroid's future path will be determined. So, in the blink of an eye, during this brief cosmic rendezvous, the future of Apophis will be decided. Will it continue its current path, or will it be nudged onto a new trajectory? Only time will tell. This means Apophis's future and ours could be decided in that brief encounter. The moment when Apophis is closest to Earth will be a critical one. As we delve deeper into this cosmic ballet, we come to the climax, the moment of truth. The point when our planet's gravitational pull will be at its strongest, tugging at the asteroid as it whizzes by. At this juncture, Earth's gravitational influence will be keenly felt by Apophis. This might seem like a delicate dance, but it's more akin to a wrestling match. A tug of war between two celestial bodies with one trying to continue on its set path and the other trying to pull it in a new direction. What could be the possible outcomes? Well, they range from subtle to significant. On one end of the spectrum, Apophis might experience a slight change in its trajectory, a minor detour on its cosmic journey. If this happens, it's unlikely that we'll notice any immediate changes. But it's an alteration that could have far-reaching effects down the line. On the other end of the spectrum, Apophis might undergo a more dramatic shift in its course. This could mean that the asteroid is pulled closer to Earth during its next pass, or it might be flung further out into the solar system. This is a less likely outcome, but it's one that scientists are keeping a close eye on. Regardless of the outcome, this encounter will provide us with an unprecedented opportunity. As we observe Apophis's close approach and track its path, we'll gather invaluable data. This will help us refine our understanding of asteroids and how they interact with our planet's gravity. It's a chance to learn, to grow, and to prepare for future encounters with these celestial visitors. So, as we look forward to the year 2029, we wait with bated breath for this dance of gravity to unfold. We watch as our planet reaches out to this cosmic traveler, influencing its path and shaping its journey. Whatever happens, it will be a moment that could rewrite Apophis's path and our understanding of these cosmic visitors. Following the asteroid's close encounter with Earth, it's time to reflect on the key points of this fascinating event. The gravitational dance between Earth and Apophis is a reminder of the powerful forces at play in our universe. Earth's gravity, much like an unseen puppet master, has the potential to influence the path of Apophis. This interaction can result in minor or significant trajectory changes, depending on the exact distance at which Apophis passes. But let's not forget the implications of this event. The close approach of Apophis provides an unparalleled opportunity for scientific discoveries. Scientists will be able to study Apophis up close, gaining insights into its composition and structure. These findings could contribute to our understanding of asteroids and the early solar system. Moreover, the Apophis event could bring about changes in how we track asteroids. It's a reminder that we share our cosmic neighborhood with countless other objects, some of which could cross paths with Earth. The lessons learned from Apophis could help us enhance our asteroid detection and tracking methods, enabling us to better prepare for future encounters. So while Apophis's visit might be a fleeting event in astronomical terms, its impact could be long-lasting. It's a wake-up call, reminding us of the potential threats lurking in space, but it's also a celebration of the wonders that the cosmos holds. It's a testament to our quest for knowledge, our resilience, and our ability to turn potential threats into opportunities for learning and growth. Regardless of the outcome, Apophis's close approach will be a wake-up call to the potential threats and wonders that space holds. 
We've taken a journey from introducing you to the asteroid Apophis and its upcoming close encounter with Earth in 2029 to exploring the potential impact of Earth's gravitational pull on this celestial visitor. We've delved into the science behind gravitational forces, how they can tug at and alter the trajectory of celestial bodies like Apophis. We've highlighted the critical moment when Apophis will feel Earth's gravitational influence and discussed the possible outcomes of this encounter. This interaction between Earth and Apophis underscores the importance of monitoring asteroids and understanding their movements. It's a reminder of our place in the cosmos and how we are part of a larger, dynamic universe that's always in motion. Thank you for joining us on Time Pilgrimage. And as always, please remember to subscribe, like, and comment if there's a topic you'd like us to explore. Drop a comment below. Until next time.